for those of us that are doing this work, those of us that are connecting with the animals and whether you call it translating or speaking for the animals or, or, you know, however you see your own connection, we're here to bring the depth of that clarity right smack into the middle of humanity. And it takes a profound commitment to keep your awareness with a priority of your own experience rather than trying to control or manipulate someone else's experience so they can feel what you feel. It sounds very simple, but it's not terribly easy because of the conditioning we've had, right? We're, we're conditioned to pay attention to what we're told. We're conditioned to pay attention to what we think we're doing is correct or not. We're conditioned to pay attention to our projection right. of what somebody else is going to think about what I do or say. And it gets very complicated. It's the water we swim in, in, in this, this society. In order to progress in consciousness, it doesn't really work to circle and circle and circle with the answers that we have already discovered. When we want to grow and progress, it really helps when you have a friendship between your mind, your body, and your heart, so that when it's time to go beyond what you know, you can do it from a sense of actual embodied safety, where your mind knows where to go to find information it's never seen before, and that's through the senses of the body.